The Labour oh, yes. Party now has embraced proposals to abolish the House of Lords. What's your own view of that? Look, you know, people will say, well, it's clumsy, it's unworkable, we've got more and more peers who never carry out duties, question marks over others. Is that what we should have? What I would say is, what we have seen, the second chamber has been very, very useful to the House of Commons. It's been refining the business, getting bills tidied up, sending them back in good order. And that's why the second chamber has been very, very useful. What I would say is I don't believe and I don't think we should have a second house that's elected. I don't want competition. Who is, who's is who got supremacy? At the moment, it's very clear. The House of Commons, the elected house, is supremacy. Once you have a second house that's elected, then you're into a, you're into an arm wrestle about who has the power. What I would say is, if people want to reform it, please do, but do not have a second elected house. We don't need the competition. Supremacy is going to remain with the Commons. That is what people recognise as the senior house. We don't want any arm struggles. We want a very clear, distinct powers separated, very very easily straightforward, but not via an election.